During this week, I know you're going to be hearing lots of campaign commercials, debates, and speeches, but if I could sit down with you for just a personal moment, this is what I would say. Our nation is stuck in a funk right now, but I have the solutions to our problems. We need to get people back to work. Everybody deserves a chance at success, whether they are black, white, gay, straight, education, or no education. My opponents have views that may or may not be similar to mine, and that's okay, but they don't have the history of politics like I do. Hi, my name's Maddie. I'm Danielle's right hand. I'm her go-to. If you're running against her, that's a bold move. Danielle Proffitt is a candidate for this upcoming presidential race. She grew up in the Upper West Side of Kansas City and was bred from a family of masterminds. Her great-great-great-grandparents invented the first electric pencil sharpener. Throughout her family tree, there is, a, there is magic in the Prophet genes. She is a strong candidate with a variety of qualities that are suitable for the next President of the United States. She is a strong, independent, caring leader. Danielle, also known as Danielle, <laughs> also known as Danny, has a strong sense between what's good and what's the right choice, not only for her, but for her people and the com community surrounding her. She is a firm believer in what she thinks is right and what she thinks is wrong. Danielle studied business and law at Harvard University in Massachusetts. She graduated from Park and South High School with a 5.0 GPA. She was valedictorian and prom queen. Danielle has been a top-notch student and the favorite out of five siblings. She's volunteered for animal shelters for her whole life. She's a lover of all the animals and is, and is an environmentalist. Her, family, her favorite holidays are Arbor Day and Earth Day. Her mother, Daniela, went to Harvard University, and her father, Daniel, went to Yale University, both majors in politics and minor in law. Hi, I'm Hannah, one of Danny's childhood best friends. She's always seen the best in people and made the right decisions, and cared for kids that didn't have any friends, just like me. But unlike some of the candidates running against her, and you even may be voting for them. You guys are hiding something, huh? No. Nothing to hide. Alright. You got anything to hide? There's a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff? Do you want that to be your president? Someone who hides a lot of stuff? Do you want a president that sits around doing nothing while everybody else is working? America is made up of people who work, and he doesn't. You want a president that stands for you, and stands for the country and your rights, not jingle bells. So when Josh Kapler says Jingle Bells is what he's all about, is that really what you want? Drinking and driving do not mix, especially when you are in possession of drugs. Do you really want Ring as your next president? Um, acid? If Chance the Rapper does it, then Jasmine does it? Doesn't sound like a leader to me. Sounds more like a follower. August 24th, 2011. Jared Hernandez publicly stated that he hates people. That means you. I've been an African American my whole life, and Danny Prophet has supported me through thick and thin. She has my vote. Danny Prophet was the top of her class in my theoretical and organic chemistry class. Hey guys, my name is Grant Pace. I'm the salutatorian, and 
you know, I'm not happy about coming in second, but Danny Profit's pretty great. I'm not bitter about it at all. Like, Even other committees support Danny Profit. I'm Robert Neal, and I support Danny Profit. Thank you. I'm Danny Profit, and I approve this message.